Opening weekend concludes on a beautiful Sunday afternoon. Ball game. See if they can get back going again today. And the first pitch is in for a strike at 94. We are open for business. Here. And Decker draws a leadoff walk. Yeah, right off the bat. And he sends a worm burner down the left, or through the left side for a base hit. Good pitch. Swing and a miss. That looked like a little sharper break. Yeah, we didn't that feature time. that while yeah. we talked about curveball. That Fly ball the other way to right, slicing away from Josh Hall, but he's more than got the wheels to make that catch. Runner will tag from second on a third. So Decker moves up, and now runners on the corners with two. Runner takes off from first, a throw down. They get the out, but the runner takes off from third. The delay, the steal. delay steal. Yeah, delay steal, mm -hmm. Wally. And they get the out to keep the run off the board. So an aggressive play here by Presbyterian. But Steven Williams behind the plate. Get Quiet. Just kind of pick it up, put it down, and then hanging curveball. Off the wall. The green monster in left center. Bliss has got yet another extra base hit. Double for Bliss and Auburn. Bear into the dirt. Bliss takes off for third. Wyatt's throw down is on the money, and Bliss is out. Well, there's a reason the senior catcher has been lauded for his defense throughout He's done they, his college hey, career. Hey, Bush Thompson highlighted him yesterday when the game was over, uh -huh. just his talk. But watch what happens here. It's a good read by Bliss. The ball gets away from Wyatt, but, man, he jumps on it, makes a great throw. Called good. strike three, painting the black with the fastball. Good pitch. Mm, good take. 3-2 slider. Really good call, trying to make a pitch in a fastball count and just missed. This guy's now Landon Shaw, runner takes off from first. There's a hand cannon and on the money. And for the second straight inning, Steven Williams unleashes a fire hose to close out the frame. One more look as he catches Jake Wyatt dead to rights at second base. And Hall rolls one to first base. Might Can't be, be a base too hit. casual. And he got it. safe he got it. at first. Chase Hughes tried to take it himself. And here's Brody Moore. Runner takes off. No surprise. Pitch a called strike. And they got him. That just tells you how good Jake Wyatt's Wyatt. arm is. Man, and Butch Thompson was high-fiving him last night verbally, and he's going to do it again now. Might not right now at this moment, but impressive. Quick to the play by Howard, but then watch the release. Just gone. Absolute cannon against maybe the fastest guy in the SEC. And got him. Mm. Round ball punched up the middle for a base hit. Doesn't and always happen like that, Wally. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to say much about Brody Moore, but, I, you know, there it is again. Oh, my word. Brian Bliss trying to crowd the plate there with two strikes. Now, Barnett showing he can be counted on. Jumps on that hanger all the way into the left field corner. Ward plays it off the wall. Klein. Is going to slide in safely at second with a leadoff double. That's got to feel good for the three-hole third baseman. They swing. We're going to swing. Swinging away and a liner off the back lip into right field for a base hit, and they're going to stop Klein at third. Back-to-back -back hard hit balls by Klein and Toth. Rounded third base, Woolley's going to try and come home. The throw is perfect and out at home plate, Sean Klein. How about Auburn's defense? Again. Mason Barnett appreciates the work. Again, but all kind of mistakes there, I think, Wiley. With nobody out, you don't go on contact, and you sure don't go when the ball's hit right to the third baseman. You know, just with nobody out, you can afford to stand there and see if they can make a play. Auburn, that is, but a great play by Wolin, a great play by Stephen Williams to catch. Grounded sharply, tough hop. Willie's going to try and get to the bag. He drops it and safe at third base. Eric Toth belly flops into the pillow. And that bobble cost. Swing and a miss. Couldn't catch up to the high heat. 2-1, right to Woolley. This time he knocks it down, and it is bare hand. He steps atop the bag. And for the third time in the last two games, Presbyterian College leaves him loaded. 
Off-speed pitch. So, oh, slip and a fall. Oots from his knees. Unable to get the out. Mm. It's about the only blemish. He saves a lot of money now to buy razors. <laughs> a five-pitch walk, though. An assistant at Auburn on the football team. Hit him in the leg. He's a tough kid. That's the second time he's been hit down there. Once it's off his bat. Yeah. <laughs> On the corner. Beautiful spot. It was that same side of the plate, but away to the lefty. And Duncan Howard. He oh, it's a freshman. <laughs> and a one-out walk to Judd Ward and Bryson Ware. Lost him. Ball four. Rankin Woolley. Spo. He goes oppo in the air, high in the air to right, but Toth's got it measured. The squeeze and another scoreless inning from the baseball hat. 3-1 is scalded up the middle. Good effort by Oots, but that's into center field. A base hit for the Tigers. And Stephen Williams aboard at first. And throw gets away towards the tarp down the right field line. Williams is going to run right through second. He's trying for third. The throw that direction is on a hop, and Williams is in safely. A two base throwing error. And maybe that'll be the straw that breaks this scoreless affairs back. Short hopped it. Stevens diving back over his back. No chance for the first baseman to get it at all. And then good hustle by Stephen Williams. Big guy, but he's a good runner. Great job of base running. Inside, ball four. Some reason. Hall on the first pitch. Laces a liner to left. Great catch by Raspberry, but that's going to untie this ball game. A sack fly from Josh Hall makes it one nothing Auburn in the sixth. Just good baseball. Good hitting. Wiley, get a pitch and go get it. Runner takes off from first. Pitch is inside, and no throw down from Wyatt this time. And... I'm certain that Josh, or I guess that's Casey Howell yep. up there at second, but I Anders 3-1 is hit high in the air. Ballpark's going to hold it. Center fielder Decker squares the shoulder and sashaying back to his left. Makes the Brooks can hold this. The defense can hold it. Line drive smoked into center field for a base hit. Lead off single and a pinch hit for Jeremiah Boyd. Yeah, good, good way to start Jeremiah his season. Boyd. I don't think we've seen him yet. That's his nope, first that's at bat. Uh -huh. oh. oh, two. Line drive to right center, down for a base hit, and it gets past Josh Hall in right field, and this is going to tie the game. And just like that, we're back even at one. An 0-2 pitch lined into right and gets past Josh Hall in right field. Ball hit and skipped, and I think Josh Hall took an angle maybe a little too tight, and the ball just shot by him. Good job of hitting with two. Yeah, see the angle right there? The angle was too tight, Wiley. He didn't give enough room for the skip and maybe a pitch and change here for uh, Coach Hudson. I'm, I'm assuming Seb Thomas, the big, strong right-hander against the... Without official at bat yet, two walks and hit by pitch. Ball gets away from Williams. Runner takes off for third. Willie's got the throw and the out at third. Steven Williams have a day behind the dish. He sure has. The ball kicked a little bit away from him. A bad jump there by Livingston. Stephen Williams just jumped all over it, and he's got a great arm. He played right field because he's got a great mm -hmm. arm. But he got away from him, but you just better go against an arm like that, and he didn't go. So what you, well, I tell you, if you're a pitcher, thank you so much. I just got an out without making a pitch. You don't have to get the third. 2-1, oh. slap through the left side for a base hit. Now how big is that? Just insult to injury, isn't uh -huh. it? Uh-huh. You know, you may not score there because it wasn't that deep. Sends a grounder to third across the diamond. Woolley, a little high, but handled by Mitt. Cueto. There you go. That's and a, a leadoff walk, walk yep. to Judd Ward. Gives staff. Grounded sharply to short. Gathered the throw to first on the money from Landon Shaw. And another scoreless inning from Presbyterian pitching. Tied it. <laughs> Ripped down the right field line and fair. And David Sweat, his first at bat of the day after coming in as a pinch runner, sends a missile to right and a brilliant play in right by Josh Hall to hold him to just a single. Yeah, that's the speed. That's Hard hit grounder picked by Moore. Out at second. Hung oh, to first. Oh, my goodness. Ole. 
base. Six for three, Brody Moore, Mr. Baseball. <laughs> wow. That's got to have Ryan Bliss smiling in the dugout. And this is how Auburn goes to the bottom of the ninth. They got a chance to walk it off. I mean, off the end just, of the bat, it's going to dunk in for a base hit, and the winning run is aboard. It's just stupid, isn't it? It's just <laughs> beautifully stupid. <laughs> now you have a... Called strike three. He locked up Farquhar, and Chris Veach pounds his glove, high fives into the dunk. 1-0 is club to right field. Hall Speed. coming on. Speed. That was a long run for Josh Hall. But he Hard hit. In. Fair inside the third base bag into the corner. Woolley digging for second. The throw coming in. And Woolley is safe at second base with a one-out double. Brown ball up the middle and through. Weekend in 2021. Bobby Pierce, the hero.